Middle Georgia Pride, Jeffersonville. Chuck Lavelle, you may know the name from the Rolling Stones or the Almond Brothers, but would you believe the keyboardist is also a farmer? Though his first passion is music, Lavelle has been a tree farmer for 30 years. 41 NBC's Melissa Lee has more from Twiggs County as we kick off Middle Georgia Pride, Jeffersonville. He probably wouldn't have become a tree farmer if it weren't for his wife, whose interest is in saving the land. But I really started gravitating towards forestry. For one thing, I realized that my instrument that's given me my career comes from what? The resource of wood. So uh, that kind of struck a nerve with me. And he's been fascinated with forestry ever since. Chuck Lavelle says both music and tree farming offer opportunities to leave a legacy. When you're recording with these artists, you have an opportunity to uh, create recordings that are going to last uh, many, many lifetimes on into the future. And when you're managing a forest, you have the same opportunity. You can plant seedlings today that are going to be this big that someday 75, 100 years, 150 years or even more are, are still going to be here. His mantra is simple. Leave the land in better shape than you found it. Trees and forests give us so many incredible things. They give us materials to build our homes and our schools and churches. They give us materials to make books and magazines and newspapers. Uh, there are some 5,000 products that we use in our everyday life that has some element of trees in it. He's a rock and roller who enjoys living off the land but he seems to think differently. As far as I'm concerned, I'm just a good old country boy. <laughs> and I mean that uh, sincerely. I, I love living in Twiggs County. I, I love engaging in outdoor activities. In Twiggs County, Melissa Lee, 41 NBC News. Laval has even written various books on conservation issues. His latest one, Growing a Better America, talks about smart growth and pressure on our natural lands.